So first of all, there is to say that there is no recipe for a successful public engagement process that works for every project, you know, so there is no solution that fits all. But of course, we can make some general recommendations, which factors are especially important to consider when planning public engagement. And first of all, contextual factors are of a certain importance in order to find out what measures make the most sense in the particular case. So a first step is to define who is there, who is the target group, who is directly, who is indirectly affected by the project. You know, things like the characteristics of an area, the community, the stakeholders, what's the historical, what's the political context of the area and what visions in terms of energy solutions exist and so on. And by having this information about the background, it can be figured out what concrete measures to use to involve the public and also when these measures should be used. So in which project phase it actually makes most sense. So when does it make sense to inform about technical aspects? When is the best time to offer financial participation? And so on, you know, that always depends on the individual course of the project. And this is also why I said in the beginning that there is no solution that fits all. And maybe one last aspect that's important to consider, how can conflicts be resolved? Depending on the source of the conflict, there are different resolution strategies possible. Sometimes it's important to focus on the emotional level, sometimes it's needed to reduce uncertainty or increase knowledge, or sometimes it's about providing more possibilities for co-decisions, for example. And a good practice approach can be realized by keeping all these different factors in mind. And for example, this is exactly what the ongoing case study in Iceland, Husavik Community Greenhouse, is trying to achieve by addressing all those issues. So this case is promising to provide a good example on how to engage the public in a geothermal project.